the ocean, a place of mystery. Its dark, silent depths hold secrets we've barely begun to understand. For centuries, navies feared what lurked below, the unseen enemy. From the German U-boats of World War I to the silent nuclear submarines patrolling today, the ocean floor has always been a chessboard of shadows. But in the modern era, one aircraft has emerged as the master of this game. A plane that blends speed, stealth, and advanced technology to detect what most of us can't even imagine. This is the Boeing P-8 Poseidon, a submarine hunter, a guardian of the seas, and perhaps one of the most decisive aircraft in shaping the balance of naval power today. Picture the 1940s. The world at war. Entire convoys carrying food, oil, and ammunition were vanishing beneath the waves, torpedoed by German U-boats. The Allies needed a way to protect their lifelines. So they turned to aircraft, flying patrols across endless oceans, searching for periscopes and shadows in the water. This was the birth of maritime patrol aviation. But as decades passed, the threat grew. Submarines became faster, quieter, deadlier. By the Cold War, the stakes were higher than ever. Nuclear submarines carried missiles that could destroy cities, and they were designed to hide beneath the oceans, invisible to satellites and radars. The U.S. Navy relied heavily on the Lockheed P-3 Orion, an aircraft that served faithfully for over 50 years. But technology evolves, and by the early 2000s, the Orion was showing its age. What was needed was a new aircraft. Faster. Smarter. Capable of covering vast oceans and hunting submarines in ways the Orion never could. Enter the Boeing P-8 Poseidon. On the surface, the P-8 might look familiar. That's because it's built on the body of the Boeing 737, the same jet many of us have flown on for vacations or business trips. But make no mistake, this is no airliner. The transformation begins with reinforced structures, advanced sensors, and military-grade communication systems. The commercial bones of a 737 are stripped and reimagined into a weaponized guardian of the oceans. First flown in 2009, the P-8 quickly proved itself. It could fly higher and faster than the P-3 Orion, cover greater distances, and most importantly, it carried an arsenal designed for one mission, to hunt submarines. Inside, its cabin isn't filled with passenger seats. Instead, rows of operator consoles line the fuselage, where crews of specialists stare into glowing screens, analyzing data from sonobuoys dropped into the ocean below. Think of it as a flying brain, a nerve center connecting satellites, ships, and sensors across thousands of miles. So how does the Poseidon hunt what cannot be seen? It starts with sonobuoys small, cylindrical devices dropped from the aircraft that parachute into the ocean. Once in the water, they deploy hydrophones, listening for the faintest sounds, the quiet hum of a submarine engine the rhythmic turn of a propeller, even the sound of water moving around a hull. The Poseidon can deploy dozens at a time, creating an invisible underwater net. Then comes its magnetic anomaly detector, an instrument capable of sensing tiny disturbances in Earth's magnetic field, often caused by large metal objects like submarines. From the air, the Poseidon can also scan the surface using radar, track ships, or spot even a periscope breaking the waves. And when it finds its prey, the Poseidon is no mere scout. It carries harpoon anti-ship missiles, depth charges, and even torpedoes, turning it into a lethal predator. Imagine the scene. A submarine slips silently beneath the waves, thinking it is unseen. Above, at 30,000 feet, a Poseidon is already watching. It has mapped its movements, predicted its path, and waits for the order. In seconds, the hunter becomes executioner. Today, the world's oceans are alive with hidden tension. China is expanding its submarine fleet, deploying nuclear-powered vessels into the South China Sea. Russia maintains a formidable undersea presence, 
with subs capable of striking NATO targets within minutes. And in this shadow war, the P-8 Poseidon has become indispensable. In 2018, NATO deployed Poseidons across the North Atlantic to track an unusual surge in Russian submarine patrols. The aircraft uncovered routes, shadowed subs, and relayed intelligence in real time. It was like a silent chess match. Each move countered before the opponent even realized they'd been seen. But the Poseidon isn't just about hunting submarines. Its sensors make it a powerful surveillance platform, capable of monitoring entire fleets, tracking piracy routes, or even providing humanitarian aid by spotting survivors at sea. And because it's based on a commercial airframe, it can operate from many runways around the world, giving it global reach. Countries like India, Australia, and the United Kingdom have all acquired Poseidons, recognizing that in the modern era, control of the seas often begins with control of the skies above them. But what does the future hold? Submarines are evolving. Some are near silent, coated in special materials that absorb sonar. Others are autonomous drones, capable of patrolling the oceans without a crew. In response, the P-8 itself is evolving. New systems are being integrated. Artificial intelligence to process massive amounts of sonar data. Advanced networking to link with drones, satellites, and ships. And next-generation weapons to counter stealthier threats. Imagine fleets of unmanned underwater vehicles working hand-in-hand -hand with Poseidons, creating an ocean-wide surveillance web. Or swarms of aerial drones launched mid-flight extending the Poseidon's reach far beyond the horizon. The ocean of tomorrow will be even more contested, more dangerous, and more unpredictable. And in that vast arena, the Poseidon will remain at the heart of the hunt. From the convoys of World War II to the high-tech cat-and-mouse games of today, the mission has remained the same. Protect the seas, safeguard the lifelines of nations, and deter the unseen enemy below. The Boeing P. 8 Poseidon is more than an aircraft. It is a symbol of how far we've come in mastering the art of detection, of outthinking the submarine, of turning the ocean from a place of vulnerability into a shield of security. But the truth is, the oceans will never stop holding secrets. And as long as submarines lurk beneath the waves, there will always be hunters watching the surface skies. This is the story of the Poseidon, the submarine hunter the guardian of the deep. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel so you never miss the next story. Thanks for watching.